Tom, I guess no surprise you guys came out uh, real quick in that first period. What was the feeling like uh, out on the ice? Yeah, you know, I think they, they've been having great uh, starts of games. I just wanted to be a part of it my first game and God, I think it's been six, seven months. So um, just get my feet moving, get in on the forecheck and, uh, you know, try to play with pace and play into the systems that they have. Did you feel like it was just, as they say, riding a bike, getting right back to it? Yeah, I mean, I, I think I had nerves for the first time for a game in, in a long time, but, you know, it's, it was a seven-month break, and, you know, I'm happy to get that one out of the way. Tell me about the goal and, and what happened on that sequence. Uh, it was a set uh, breakout. I think uh, the D just moved it up quick to Timo. He, he, uh, he beat his guy and then just slid it over for, I guess it's a tap in, so it's not, uh, not a great goal, but I'll take him. Uh, now, how are you feeling uh, with the five-minute uh, penalty handed out, and how are you feeling in the box? Yeah, I'm definitely nervous in the box. Um, I don't think it's a five-minute. I don't even think it's a two-minute penalty. Um, but they called it, and, uh, you know, hats off to our PK for bailing me out. When you see the PK come up big like that, does that uh, put a little jolt in the boots uh, going down the stretch? Yeah, you know, I think that they had a tough one last night. They wanted to show um, that they could come back and, you know, compete and shut down their power play, and I think they did a great job. They worked as a unit. Hutch back there was great. Um, I think he bailed us out a few times, not only on that power play, but uh, throughout the second period. So it's nice to come out there with two points. Great relief, too, seeing that goal in overtime. Yes, it was. Or shoot shootout, out. yes, it was a great relief. I'm... Uh, you know, I was happy once I got out of the box there. It was uh, definitely nerve-wracking.